I am cute today, okay? Hmm, looks like he's cosplaying as both his grandparents at the same time. Well, you are what you eat. Wait, does that not apply here? Hey, you fabulous flatulence, welcome to MK. I'm the voice cracking Jack, and today it's time to feast on some deliciously, amazingly well-crafted insults. Here we have Miss Riley Reed with her definitely very well-executed rap song. Yep, his glasses have better zoom than the NASA telescopes. Huh, nice tried insulting me, but my eyes are that weirdly freakishly big. She's Ben Shapiro's sister, and she looks like a default sim? Ugh, pick a struggle. How do y'all be 27 plus with no kids? Seeing y'all be 23 with five kids will do that to you. Wait, you're telling me there's more to life than forgetting to wear a condom? Get out of here. He looks like if someone tried drawing Tom Scott's face from memory. Okay, but this guy looks beautiful. I... <laughs> <laughs> Is it still kind of a fail if it still looks nice? I didn't know that my septic tank could talk. Ooh! <laughs> Dax Shepard looks like if Benedict Cumberbatch evolved on dry land. So either Dax Shepard looks like the primate version of Benedict, or Benedict looks like the fish version of Dax. <laughs> David Guetta looks like the exchange student who doesn't know English but is still there vibing. <laughs> uh, take me back to the good old days in high school where we teach all the exchange students swear words and make them yell them out in class. They've survived for 600 million years without a brain. A ray of hope for some of my BBC colleagues. Boy looks like a cold glass of coke fizzled over. Hey, right, come here champ, I just need to top up. <laughs> Charlie's eyebrows have more definition than my life. Boy, I think that's just Charlie in general. That cold-blooded Keanu Reeves cross Jesus Christ mother flipper. Hi, Ben. Would you let go for $150 today? How about you go find a nice pond to swim in? Cause you're a silly goose if you think I'll take $150 for a $900 computer. Okay, okay, fine. 160. FIFA 21 Gameplay Features! EA never disappoints us when it comes to disappointing us. Now see, that's actually their secret new business strategy. Make games so disappointing that you play them for how disappointing they can be. If Tommy Wiseau can make a big success out of it, then so can they. Meanwhile, in anime, it's like you were only born to add the scent of garlic to fried rice oil. Which one's saying this? I don't know, because I've never seen the show. I bet you're a lesbian. Only when I talk to you! Never forget that Eminem dissed Machine Gun Kelly so hard he switched genres. Okay, honestly, I saw the profile picture here first and I thought they were referring to genders. I mean, come on, let's be honest. No man could do nail polish that well. And any man that can needs to teach me, please. I'm desperate. I want to do it. I just can't make them look nice. My wife dreamed I cheated on her. Now she wants an apology. Oh, for goodness sake. Your wife is the person who washes their hands after taking a shower. Okay, but have you lived in some share houses? Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm comparing a YouTube anime video to Pikachu. PK Russell is like a 91 degree angle. He's obtuse and never right and super annoying to look at. If we all just switched to cursive and stick shift cars, we could cripple an entire generation. I love how you all talk smack about a generation you raised like it's their fault and not yours. White girls get Dreamcatcher tattoos and wonder why their lives are going to smack. Like, I don't know, Sarah, maybe ask the thing inked on your body that attracts bad stuff you unseasoned chicken wing. You're giving off hot dog water vibes right now. Leave me alone. Ladies, please use this one at a bar. <laughs> if you can actually go to them right now. Or save it for the Zoom dates if people are still doing those. Translate this romantic sentence. Let's flex my French. Un petit enfant tiendrait son stylo mix q toy. A little child would hold his pen better than you. Yeah, well, you know what? Candy instructions envelope capital. You never realize how much you've won the DNA lottery until you watch TikTok cringe. Be careful, watching TikTok cringe is a gateway drug into watching TikTok. Do not make my mistake, my productivity has gone down so much. Just a typical day being a casual worker. He's the same guy who would say, I got kicked out of the army because I beat the stuff out of the drill instructor for getting in my face. But actually he got kicked out because he couldn't wake up early. Hey, that's me. Hmm, so this is what Mark Zuckerberg did before Facebook. Eminem has always been my inspiration. I don't care what anybody says, this is a valid reason to refund the game. Your mother probably wanted to refund you too, but even Satan didn't want you because your first words were smoked briskets are yummy. Are, are they not? <laughs> Wait, am I on the wrong side of history? You are like the heel on a loaf of bread. 
Everyone's touched you, but no one wants you. Hey, he looks like a dollar store Christian Bale. You're as useless as the word you in the word Q. Name a better trio. The bathroom, a toilet, and Pepto-Bismol. That's exactly how I fight off my food cravings. I just think about what it's gonna feel like afterwards. Though if you are into butt pain, I guess it's more of an incentive. Ethan Smith. If idiots could fly, this place would be an airport. Ooh. <laughs> Bet the school was so reluctant to put this in the yearbook. Top definition, dumbass. Someone who looks up the word dumbass in a dictionary. <laughs> Wait a minute, how did this happen? We're smarter than this. Not according to the dictionary. Ha! R slash, oh, of course it has a subreddit. Chris Jericho's band Fozzy plays in front of a packed crowd at Sturgis. No face masks or social distancing despite COVID-19. Imagine having such bad taste in music that you're willing to get COVID and die just so you can listen to Chris Jericho's band. <laughs> One of the symptoms of COVID is a loss of taste. Makes sense. Is it weird that I sold my mom for gems? How many gems? How much? 800? It's weird that they paid that much. Because that's what heroes do. Dude from Comcast fell asleep during my install and I deadass left him sleep because bro needed it. Who the frick sleeps like that? Bro looks like a Unity asset. Oh good, I'm glad I'm not the only one who's a bit weirded out by this. He's been around technology so much that his sleep pattern is just do 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 do. <laughs> I'm an organ donor, but they're also fricked up. It's more of a gesture thing. I'm told I basically can't donate organs or blood. I have a hereditary blood disorder that makes my insides incompatible with other people. That's the best excuse I've ever heard for being a virgin. What? Where did that even come from? Poor guy. Already has a rare disease, but still got burnt to the ground. <laughs> it's kind of true. Pretty classy. John McAfee arrested at airport for wearing lacy thong as a face cover. Oh. In fairness, it is the most appropriate way to cover a- <laughs> A see you guys next Tuesday. This guy tried to put LSD in the LA water supply. Just look at that photo. I bet you did. If Post Malone and Weird Al Yankovic had a son. Oh, dude, that is a really good example. Not even had a son, like literally did the fusion dance. Paul Heyman looks like the rich politics guy boomers always draw in their cartoons. Oh wow, he really does. I'm what your grandpa wants to look like. This old lady witnessing technology is the equivalent of a dog barking at a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> Wait here, hold up. Look at this quality image. How is that a video? My goodness. Okay, it might not look as good when it's zoomed up and such, but Jesus, on my computer right now, it's like a really crisp photo. Who has a camera that can do this? Why, why do I feel so poor all of a sudden? <laughs> I look like Hal from Hal's Moving Castle. It's just uncanny because we're both wearing white, you see. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Maybe Hal's Moving Hairline? Mm-hmm. Don't know what these guys are doing. Don't know where they are to do it, but I am totally feeling it. He looks like an American student who went on a field trip and never came back. Oh uh, yeah, man, this is my life now. I'm just, you know, playing the banjo. What's the name of this place anyway? Alkigahara. Sounds cool. Dan, Dan, Danny Gonzalez. The man with the jaw I... I would I'd settle with. You know, it's not that bad. You look like a cult explaining how everything works to the new girl they just kidnapped. All right, so before we get started, we're going to put this Denny Gonzalez mask on you. It's kind of a requirement to be here. But don't worry, it's not permanent. We put the actual face on through surgery next week. Meanwhile, in our slash, I am very badass. I never been a violent person, but if someone laid a hand on you, I will drive their skull to my kneecap until I see red. Yeah, that sounds badass. Yeah, I'll put that on my TikTok video. Dude looks like Princess Leia on a bad hair day. Okay, I thought they were referring to some other princess, but they're referring to actual Leia, not someone named Leia. And I, I gotta say, I mean, Princess Leia ain't that bad, you know? I'm just, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Actually can't process this. What is, wait, is that not photoshopped? He looks like the Ice Age baby grown up. Boys, oh, we found him. He's back. Oh, we gotta get him. Okay, this title totally reminds me of some opening to Caillou. Let's have a quick check-in on Alex Jones to see how he's handling COVID-19 restrictions. Alex is maybe the only person on the planet who gets winded taking a breath. Dude, that's because he's such a powerful beast of a being that he just can't contain it all the time and so he loses energy really quickly. Uh, it's clear science. Posting more because I can. Ooh, sex a cowboy <laughs> with a felon <laughs> turning you gay. <laughs> Willy Wonka while the children are dying in his chocolate factory. Yeah, that's still swipe right. Adam is so deep in the closet, his mailing address is in Narnia. <laughs> I just love that analogy, that's... 
<laughs> that is so good. Condition and forecast. Let's go down the list. Stone is wet. Rain. Stone is dry. Not raining. Shadow on the ground. Sunny. White on top. Snowing. Can't see stone. Foggy. Swinging stone. Windy. Stone jumping up and down. Earthquake. Stone gone. Tornado. Wait, what's the difference though between stone gone and you can't see the stone? Like, technically that's both the same thing. Unless, my god, a foggy tornado. Steals the rock to watch everyone go crazy. I hope both sides of your pillow are hot. <gasps> you take that back, sir. I've seen Pornhub ads more trustworthy than you. Caption, waited outside a hotel for 46 hours straight for this opportunity. Worth it. Oh, oh, you can just see the discomfort on her. Oh my goodness. Madam, I honor and respect you for willing to give your time to these slightly creepy people. I mean, end of the day, I guess they're just fans who appreciate you. I at least I hope it just ends there. I bet his forehead can be scanned at a grocery store. Yep, and I bought special. <laughs> God, no, that was a really bad joke. Oh, that was a really bad joke. I shouldn't have done that one, no. <laughs> I acknowledge that there is a problem with saying that. <laughs> God damn it. Oh yes, this is from Ramsey's Hotel Nightmare spin-off thing where restaurants would, weren't doing it for him anymore. Context here is this hotel owner just kept a lot of random stuff he thought was antiques when it was all worth maybe 20 bucks. Just like how my girlfriend hoards me thinking I'm of value. <laughs> <laughs> self burn The owner looks like he just farted and doesn't know if he shat himself. Yep, okay, that was warmer than usual. That is... That is sticking around. Oh, literally, that was something stuck there. Okay, I need to go. Hard pill to swallow. Just because you need something to live doesn't make it a human right. All the kids who were born on third base and think they hit a triple are saying this. Guys of Reddit, what is socially seen as sexy but is actually a huge turnoff for you? The Kardashian look. Oh, yes. All for you if that's what you want to look like, but if you're doing it because you think guys are into that, oh, oh no. Have you ever seen a front view of Kim? She looks like a crushed water bottle. This man looks like an adult Charlie Brown. Then why doesn't he sound like a tuba? There is inconsistency in this law. This guy permanently looks like a kid about to tell his parents he broke a window. <laughs> <laughs> the eyebrows. It's the eyebrows and the forehead that's doing it. Damn, he could trip somebody in a different state. <laughs> That is mean, but somewhat factual. Ah, oh, it's the good Samaritan himself. Jake Paul is the kind of guy who would climb a glass wall to see what's on the other side. <laughs> oh. Ah, but what if he's blind? There we go, that's something Jake Paul can make a YouTube video out of. Berlin looked like the big bad wolf when he was trying to be grandma. <laughs> Hey, what's up? You guys want cookies? It's not that cold. Why does it look like he has a mustache even when he doesn't? Oh, is that gonna be the next Mandela effect? Gus Johnson never had a mustache. Do -do 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 -do. Oh my gosh, what is this? What the hell is this? Oh, that poor, terribly influenced little kid. And then there's the toddler in front of him. Oh, listening to this cured my depression. I found someone who I hate more than myself. Opinion. France and Italy's rising tensions are as high as World War II. Should we be worried? Considering how useless both countries were in World War II, no. Yeah, and I think they definitely have the support of their citizens in this current time to go to war. Not even sending over guns and tanks and stuff, just a bunch of people all sneezing all over the place in each other's territory. She's had enough black DNA in her, she probably has some Assassin's Creed memories of slavery. Ah, so that's why she thinks she has an N-word pass. Pokemon GameStop, power to the players. Ugh, I love how they put a tiny girl to make it look bigger than it is. <laughs> Hope that doesn't hit too close to home. Jeez, GameStop, be nice. Women, what surprised you the most the first time you saw or played with a peepee? -pee? The veins. My little chicken is more shredded than my arms. Funny, since they're getting the exact same amount of exercise. <laughs> Take that, virgin. <laughs> uh, let's be honest, the person who said this is also a virgin. Ah, great content, but uh, there's more plastic in your butt cheeks than there is in the common turtle. Ooh, r slash rare insults. Ask Reddit, women of Reddit, what gives you an instantaneous lady boner? A good joke that a man makes up in a course of a conversation. An unexpected smart play with words. You single? My whole life's a joke. How important is the smart part? Sorry ladies, I'm taken. Taken as a joke, that is. Gosh, I love it. What, the first comment and immediately all the guys are replying to it trying to flirt with her as an attempt to get her approval. Edgar looks like a depressed 40 year old father who just lost his job. Oh. <laughs> Don't make cute puppies seem sad. That's, that's sad. Tell you that she loyal, we gonna put her to the test. I'm hoping I sung that wrong just so I can be assured that Jake Paul has some level of originality. Jake Paul is the type of guy to stand outside in the sun to dry his sweat. Well, eventually it would work, so. <laughs> 
Cooked pork, anyone? Anybody have some nice, deliciously baked pork? This is why we need a lifeguard in the gene pool. Now, before we go, today's fan art is by Emma Mayonnaise. It is a drawing of them drawing a drawing. And oh my gosh, I love it. It is so pretty. Unfortunately, this is a rare insult video, so to keep with the theme, I do have to make fun of it. Um, it's bad, like, uh, it's, it's, you suck, you suck. I, I can't do rare insult well, I'm sorry. <laughs> and remember guys, if you'd like to see your fan art on the videos at all in the future, be sure to post your work in the MK subreddit. Now we have reached the end of today's programming. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy today's content, be sure to like this video and keep assured that you are in fact subscribed to the channel. Get the notification bell clicked so you're always updated on the latest of goods. But alas, that does us for today, so I must say farewell. My name has been Jack. You have been a delightfully delicious being to dialect with? I don't know. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.